Hi guys, this is an impromptu video. I was cooking potato greens today and I just thought I'd share the process with you guys. Hope you enjoy. All right. Today, I'm cooking potato greens. I went to the farmer's market. I got me some fresh potato greens this morning. And usually I just um, pick the greens, wash it and put it in my Ziploc bags to go in the freezer. But today I'm cutting it um, the Liberian style. So this is Liberian style of cutting potato greens. Also, you can just wash the greens and rub the greens, but yeah, this is how we cut it. And my knife is really nice. You need a really good um, sharp knife that can just slice right through the greens. All right, I'll show you the rest when it's ready. Okay, so here's the greens all cut up. Um, I got some onions on top of it, ready to fry. And then over here, I've um, parboiled all my meats and stuff in here. And right now, I'm gonna fry my shrimp because I like my shrimp to put in my shrimp last into the greens and I like for it to stay um, pink. I don't like it to turn green, so I don't boil it and I don't fry it up with gas. I fry it separate and I put it in last. Then I got a little bit of fried chicken over here. So that's what's going into the potato greens. Okay. So the shrimp is fried. I'm about to take it out of the pot. I have a big pot, but only it's not because I'm, you know, I make big meals all the time, but only because, um, I like my food to spread out <laughs> when it's cooking, and so that's why I use a big pot. My sister, uh, Olede, actually gave me this pot, and I love using it because no matter how much food you make, it just spread it out. You can kind of have room to cook, so that's why I like this pot. All right, so I got the things in the pot. I think I might need a little bit more oil in here, but I'll stir it a little bit and see. Um, got the greens and the onions there. Just stir it a little bit and close it a little bit to make sure. Mm -hmm. Make sure that the oil is okay. Because sometimes when the greens cook down, the oil and the greens balances out. So I'll let it cook down and see a little bit. I'm holding the camera and recording and trying to do this. I said, wow, I, I don't know how um, Norma <laughs> does it or the other people that do cooking stuff. This is just something I was just trying to share my Sunday with you guys. I'm not going to be doing cooking videos and all of that. I'm just trying to share my Sundays, but my Sunday. So that's how I was making potato greens today so but yeah we'll check back so it turned out I did not need any more um oil but how you can fool how you usually fool people so see the oil oil is there yeah so it's just gotta cook down and I don't try not to do too much oil anyways um yeah try to cut down a little bit on the oil and all of those things that we do. Even um, my chicken here, I use my new wave oven to um, to do my chicken instead of frying it. So, but sometimes, you know, with the Latino food, there's no way there's, um, you can't get away from, you know, frying some of the stuff or it won't have the same taste. So, um, yeah. I like that's the green which is frying right now. It looks good. I love the cut up look where you cut it up with your hand. I love that look. But sometimes you don't have the time to cut it up. So, you know, we use the um, 
food processor and also we just you know we buy it from the farmer's market and we um, wash it and rub it we put it in the freezer then when you're ready to cook it you just knock it um, while it's frozen and it breaks up and then you you know you just cook it cook it like that so that's what we do Greens is frying, and my favorite part of the greens is the stem. See those little stems in there? That's my favorite. That's why I like to cut it by hand because I like those stems. And even collard greens too. I like to put my uh, collard in the food processor when I don't have time, but when I have time, I like to cut it by hand because I love the stem of the greens. So we're just gonna let it fry up for a little bit and then I'm gonna um, add um, the meats over here that I already parboiled. And these are all stuff I had in my freezer. So um, I had a little bit of, a little bit of everything. I'm not gonna start naming everything that in there. <laughs> it's just stuff I had in my freezer. Um, the only um, thing that I got today, I got um, the shrimp because I really want a shrimp in there. So the, this is the shrimp that's already fried. So, and then I had the, done the chicken um, and my new wig. All right, so. There we go. So we'll let it fry and then I'll combine everything and then I'll show you. Okay, I'm gonna combine the meats into the greens now. Okay guys, so here's the greens with everything added to it. I've added the chicken and I've added the um, meats that I parboiled. Yeah, and now it's gonna cook down. Like I said, everything is um, going to be, everything that I put in the um, pot that I parboiled was from my freezer, so um, I didn't really go grocery shopping for these greens, just the greens by itself that I went shopping for. And of course, um, the shrimp right here. So the shrimp's gonna be added last. So, um, yeah, it's gonna cook down a little bit. All right, this is the greens. Okay, so I'm about to add the shrimp there. So they sell like lots of shrimp, so I'm adding all of it <laughs> in there. So soup is almost dry, so I'm adding the shrimp into it. Greens is almost done. Yeah, let me zoom in. And you can see. Like I said, I like to use the big pot so that everything can spread out. Not that it's so you know so full or fill up the pot so much, but I like my um, food to spread out. And it's cooking. One of my subscribers um, said that they really like potato greens. So, <laughs> B, this is for you. Let's eat them. <laughs> this is the, okay. Mm -mm -mm. That is good. Just tasted it. Perfect. Enough pepper. Everything. Yep. Right. So it's dry now. I'm about to turn the stove off. 
So on our plate, I will show you. Okay. All right, guys. So here is the finished product. And um, it is really, really looking good. I love fresh greens because it's nice and green. Yep. And it's nice. And I'm about to sit down and enjoy this. So hope you enjoy this video, guys. All right.